in today's vlog, it's gonna be a little bit different. I haven't vlogged or recorded anything in a while. Um, had some personal family things going on. And uh, eventually I'll, I'll open it up. I'll open up to y'all about that. It's just, I'm not ready to talk about that just yet. But today's gonna be an interesting day. We're gonna go hang out with, with my buddy and it's his birthday today. So happy birthday. And today we're also gonna go pick something up from a certain shop. Stay tuned. So the reason why we were over at Joe Tech was because of this beautiful thing. No, it's not an RB. No, it's not a BMW engine. It's actually a 2JZ GTE non PBTI. And y'all remember this one. We're gonna actually put that once we've got the head off and kind of refresh it because it's only got 58,000 miles on it. And we're gonna throw it in to here. But we're also gonna make sure that these it on his yeah. what's up guys it's sunday and it's like almost like part two of this um of video and so today after going to drive i've actually changed everything up and i'm actually using their products to wash my car today i'm just doing a little re review and i'm um, really i'm excited as you can tell the car is really filthy somewhat get a little bit more depth out of that one versus that one that's pretty much caked on so first thing you want to do is uh, rinse the car down and rinse off your wheels using pressure washer but then I'll be using the FE free iron brake remover on the, the wheels for the brake dust Got the wheels finally cleaned up. It took a minute just because uh, they were really, really baked on there, but that wheel and tire cleaner um, helped out a lot, made life so much easier. And now, I'm just gonna rinse her off, and then we're gonna hit her with this one first, as Cameron stated to do Victory Auto Shampoo, as in to let it really soak in and, and do it like almost like a pre-rinse. And then we're gonna hit it with this slow-mo ceramic shampoo. And then once I do that, I'm gonna use that bucket and it's filled up with the ceramic hybrid wash and detailer concentrate just to uh, give it a wash and we can really get this wrap looking cleaned up and uh, 
hopefully get a video for you guys going. It's the end product. Um, <clears throat> my review, to be honest, is this stuff is actually very friendly to use. Um, and <laughs> outcome is outstanding. I love it. I'm looking a little rough, I'm feeling a little rough, but um, yesterday after washing my car, I kind of noticed something. <laughs> I didn't know that this could happen. And uh, fair warning, I haven't touched this bolt yet, all right? How does that even happen? Car. And I was like, all right, cool, let's, let's, let's kind of mess with the splitter a little bit. Did this number. And I noticed the thing was moving around a lot. I was like, what the heck? And I saw that there's no bolt there. I'm like, where did the bolt go? But went to Honda and got a new bolt. Boom. Boom. Let's so thread that in. But first, check if it's okay. No, it's kind of fine. Wish they could make an aftermarket one of that. It's not 14. Grab this. But yeah, this bolt is a 17. Got it threaded most of the way by hand. All done. Yay!